Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm at the stream, it's just below me here, um, and it's a really nice day. A little bit of wind, it's about 25 degrees at the moment, so I'm going to wander up here and hopefully get a few fish on the dry. So I've got a, like a Royal Wolf hopper on, it's like a mix of like a Royal Wolf and Alpha. So I'm go down, and I've got uh, um, a copper john on, a little one weighted copper john. So, just tied up and I've already found a fish. Can see him. Hopefully, we can catch him. It's not the biggest fish, but. Definitely one that we can start with. Got him. Nice. Oh, he broke me. Oh, all right. I think he broke me off. Holy shit, that's aggressive wee fish. Did he break me off? Yeah, he broke me off. Are you kidding? All right, I've just seen him come roaring in. Take the take the copper john and then went over there to that snag, got me around the snag and broke me. Far out. It wasn't a massive fish, it was only about a pound and a half, but far out. That fish definitely knows his snags. So I've crossed onto the other side. I can see better from over here. But man, it is hot. Like, supposed to get to 28 today I think so if we can get like a good rise going we might be able to catch something on the on the big like stimulator pad and be pretty sick but oh well but bit gutted that that other fish broke me off he wasn't even very big it's probably oh two pound pound and a half two pound and there's another nice fish sitting in that hole but Fortunately, he spooked. So, <clears throat> so we're just going to keep wandering up, try find some other fish, try pluck a few of them out. If all goes to plan. Stealthy and quiet as possible. Is the key. Pretty sure this is a fish up here. I just want to show you the size of this fish for a creek. Gnarly. Big fish. 
big fish. Look at the size of that fish. That is a monster for in here. He's feeding hard too. He's feeding real hard. Right, I'm going to tie on, I think, so we dry and a nymph. Hopefully we can get him that way. So I'm just watching this fish, it's sitting in behind. Same place and it took a dry. So, I think, we're going to put a dry on with a wee nymph. It's feeding real hard. Here we go, royal wolf. I'm going to wee pheasant tail. <coughs> Right. I've seen some pretty decent sized fish in here and I reckon he'd probably go four or five pound and a four or five pounder out of here is what I'd call a trophy I've only ever caught like two five pounders out of here so bloody nets getting all caught up get my rod Down my knees. Oh, spoke them, idiot. Too big of a cast in that buddy landed on him. Oh, that guts me, eh? Real good fish, that. Oh, well, there's a wee one there. Try to catch him. No, he spooked as well. And we got grass on my hook. Well, he was probably a sitter, but like, definitely should have caught him. That I am an amateur in fly fishing and stuffed it up somehow. That disappoints me, Dylan. Bad, bad angling is what I'd say. Bad angling. Still see him up there. We'll give him a bit because um, if I give him a wee bit of time, he might. Might just start on the feet again. Here he is. I think. Yep. That is him. And he's feeding. To get in the water. I don't want to spook this fish came from being high up, so we'll get down. We may put on a different dry fly, I reckon. I might be right there. Just don't know how close I can get to this fish. Feeding pretty hard. They're definitely in distance. Oh, 
actually take that? I don't know. I have to change dry flies. Got him on the dry. On the dry fly. Yes, boy. Shit, that's a good fish. That is a big fish, guys. That is a seriously big fish. On the dry. Just trying to get in there. Rod low. Get him out of there. Yep. On the dry. I'm just using a size 16 Royal Wolf. Holy shit, that's a big fish. He's got me around the rock. Uh oh. Fuck. This might turn to shit. We still got him? Unreal, I've still got him. Where's my neck? There. Holy shit, this fish has given me the hell of a run around. He's in the air. I can see him. I can see him. If we can, if we can get close enough. Got him. Oh my god. Holy shit. Look at that guys. Wow. No way. No freaking way that just happens on a dry. My god. He is way bigger than I thought. <laughs> oh. Shit to the bed. That is a bloody big fish in here. That's five pound piece of piss. On a dry fly. My lord. I am. Oh. I'll take him up here to the beach so I can get some real good shots. Holy shit. Look at place. Oh, look at that. On a dry fly. Where's that nymph there? Oh my god. Oh. That is crazy. 
it's definitely my biggest fish on a dry fly. Definitely. I'm like no shit speechless. I'm not even kidding. I'm speechless, eh? So speechless. Right. What we'll do. Holding up for the camera crew. Far. Holy shit. Look at that. On a dry. Look at the hook drawing on him. What a fish, guys. I know you can't see me in the frame, but I think we'll zoom it out. Ooh. Look at that guys, right, that is extraordinary for in here. That's never gonna get old. Oh. All right. Just gonna sit down for a little bit because. What happened there? Unreal. Oh. I don't know what to say. That, it's probably, I'd say that would be pushing the biggest fish I've caught out of here. It'd be, that would definitely be five pound eat for sure. But, oh my god. Spooked him from down the end. He come up, I gave him a little butt. And, um, just kept putting a few casts over him when he come up the top and um, yeah come up and took the dry fly I was expecting him to take the nymph and then I just seen him come up mouth open back down and yeah pretty much the rest is history eh this is awesome New Zealand summer is here and that is making the most of it.